Hi, I'm Matthew. Welcome to my channel. And today is Will It Shave Wednesday. Real quick, I'm going to wet my face. Oh yes, it's time for a shave. And today's shave soap is going to be by Sterling Soap Company. And it is Executive Man. <sighs> this is a nice scent. Oh yes, it is a dupe of the Creed Aventus. And I already have that lathered up in my Captain's Choice Copper Bowl. Right here. And I did use a quarter of a teaspoon of soap and 10 milliliters of water. And I'm going to be using, again, the Tube 2.0 from Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements. And I feel like this really brings out the stubble or it gives you the coal face, whatever you want to say. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and work that around here a little bit. I really feel like pre-shave helps me. I know some people say, you spend $20 on a tub of soap, why do you need it? I don't know, maybe I'm just sensitive. <laughs> it could even be in my head and I don't need it at all. All right, so uh, anyway, I'm used to using it, so I'm gonna keep on using it. And today so the razor that I'm gonna be using today is by Yaki, and this is a single edge uh, razor. The artisan style, similar to the Blackland Vector. And this does have a couple names. And the one that I'm thinking of is Excalibur. But there is another name and I can't think of it. Uh, there's two different variations. One has an uh, aluminum handle. It's black and uh, a chrome top. And this one has, I believe this is a stainless steel bottom. I don't know that this, um, the head is actually stainless or not it doesn't say and you know how it is when you get something from yaki you order it or at least for me uh, i order it and uh, like six months later i get it and i'm like i don't really remember ordering that <laughs> anyway the first version i will tell you um i wasn't able to use it because the pins in the head didn't align and i can show that in another video i've never used this razor i just thought that uh, i would use it today to let you guys know that if you're thinking about getting into the single edge uh, razors and you're not really sure and you're just kind of like, man, do I really want to spend $200 on a razor? This would kind of get you in there just to be able to see, you know, if it's for you. Uh, I can tell you 100% that the machining and the quality on this particular razor is nowhere near like the Blackland. So I don't want to, anybody to think that... Uh, this clone or this dupe of it is is to replace it because it definitely will not uh, match that and i do already have the blade loaded up in there because i still had a little bit of an alignment issue but uh you know hey for the price of it i think it's like 23 or something you can't really expect a whole lot from it so let's go ahead i have the feather pro blade in there and I can tell you, this has a little bit of a bite to it. Oh, yeah. Yep. Efficient, aggressive. What would you call it? Definitely a lot of blade feel. I've got two days worth of growth. And just with that pass... Past two will be interesting, I'll say that. <laughs> and if I'm feeling this already on my cheeks, I can tell you that my neck is not gonna like it. All right. Mm-hmm. Ooh. 
I'm telling you, it's got some bite or it's a little rough. Mm, I will say, watch out. Because <laughs> it, it's got... <coughs> it's killing me! It's got it, man. It's got it. Anyway, let's go ahead and get lathered up for pass two. I still have a little bit of that remaining cough. Uh, do I call it the COVID cough? I don't know. But anyway, it's still kind of lurking around. It's not nearly as bad as what it was, but every so often I get it and it takes a little bit to shake it. All right, so here we go on pass two across the grain. Oh, yeah. Hmm. I would say that if you're thinking about getting into single-edge razor, this might scare you away from the vector because the vector is way smoother. And I might be expecting a little bit of irritation from this shave. Just saying. That's one reason why I do it on Wednesdays. It gives me a little bit of time to catch up if I do have any problems. And it's just fun to say, will it shave Wednesday? As you know, the Sterling soap is excellent. There's plenty of residual slickness. I feel like it's got the glide and the protection that my face requires. I'm going to get cleaned up with some cold water, and I will be right back. I am back, and I have my ice cube here that I dropped earlier when I was getting it out of the freezer. So it's not really a cube. It's some other kind of <laughs> shape. Let's say it's asteroid shape. Oh, yeah. Wow. Using my Lancaster Black Sheep Towel. And today's aftershave splash is just going to be the Sterling Unscented. Give me a little bit of love in there. And... I need some star jelly. Here we go. A little star jelly. One pump will do you. It's more than what you need, actually, but who's going to try to count out a half or three quarter pump? Not me. Let me work this in a little bit down here because, like I said, I want to make sure that any damage that's done is sealed, sealed in for tomorrow. Well, I wasn't going to use the matching aftershave splash because I just figured let's just go ahead and get a little bit of goodness by the real deal. And I would say that <clears throat> although Sterling Executive Man is close to Creed Adventus, it's not exactly, and that's part of the uh, the clones or the dupes. It's uh, you know. It's just one of those things that's close, but it's not exact. And that gives you a little bit of uh, variation or uh, what do you want to say? Hmm, the word eludes me. Uh, you know, just a little bit of change up is what I'm trying to say. So there we go. The shave for the day. Would this be a good introductory razor if you're thinking about getting a vector? I don't know. I'd say if you like aggressive razors. Yes, if you like a mild razor, no. So um, if you would like a comparison video of the two razors, let me know in the comments below. I think that would be a fun video just to try out and see because sometimes we remember things a little different than the way they actually are. So there you have it. I will have a picture right here of everything that I use today. And if you haven't considered subscribing, do that now. And uh, click the like button or the bell to get notified for any upcoming videos. And I will see you guys on Wednesday, not Wednesday, that's today. <laughs>
I'm so used to saying that. Anyway, I will see you on Sunday Shave. You have a great rest of your week. Thank you.